So in regards to people with VSS and whether they'll go on to develop worsening symptoms or progress is a, a very important question because it's one that all patients want to know about. So two points to make about that is sometimes if you're seeing a patient who has just started to have symptoms, they can progress so that the symptoms are more bothersome or they start to develop new symptoms that they hadn't had before. So let's say they start with visual snow but don't have any of the trails or the palinopsia and two months later they start to have those after images, the trailing or the palinopsic images. So there can be a limited progression uh, that occurs at the beginning. That's what we have seen when patients come to us early in their course. But in terms of it, what we might refer to as a progressive degenerative disease, one that never stops getting worse, I have never seen that and I have never heard other physicians talk about seeing somebody just continue to progress and never stop getting worse. You know, if we could give a, a prime example of that is Alzheimer's disease. Once you start having Alzheimer's disease, it continues, it's relentless, and you degenerate and it progresses over time. We see patients with visual snow syndrome reach a plateau. Now other things can happen in their life that would potentially exacerbate their symptoms for a short period of time or potentially give them symptoms that are worse for longer periods of time. But generally speaking, the patients with visual snow syndrome should reach a plateau and not just continue to progress.